الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم شهر رمضان الذي انزل فيه القران هدى للناس وبينات من الهدى والفرقان فمن شهد منكم الشهر فليصم ومن كان مريضا او على سفر فعدة من ايام اخر يريد الله بكم اليسر ولا يريد بكم العسر ولتكملوا العدة ولتكبروا الله ولتكبروا الله على ما هداكم ولعلكم تشكرون
sisters in Islam. Indeed, he is one of the players that today we are here to discuss among important aspects of our life, that is aspect of our religion and how we can strengthen our Iman. How we can strengthen our Iman and the topic that I chose for myself and for you is something that I received from a brother Muslim, I think maybe two or three weeks ago. He had sent me a photo from my email and showed books on the shelf. And one of the books was called the Quran. And he was saying, about the caption on the photo says, not for yourself and it just struck me that this is something that we usually neglect we have neglected the Quran to the extent actually this is what we find already in the Quran where Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tells us that one of the lamentations of Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam on the day of Qiyamah would be in a form of Tahrir Al Quran Mahjura. That my people have taken, or rather my people, my community, Muslims have forsaken this Quran. Muslims have avoided the Quran. And how true is this? That we live with the Quran, we are similar to He 
he's been overtaken by sleep. He was not able to recite his, his he was not able to recite the Quran during the night, and he recited between Fajr and Duhr, Kutiba lahu ka'annama qara'ahu min al -lid. It is written for him uh, as if he recited the Quran during the night. And this is only to show that the Sahaba, and also to show that uh, the pious predecessors of Salaf al Saleh, they used to, you know, hold fast to the recitation of the Quran. They would really recite the Quran so much that even if somebody was not able to recite it during the night or maybe even during the day, you know, he would make time for that. You know, he would make time for that. Uh, 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 not, not the, the same way we find ourselves today that if you decided you wanted to recite the Quran, you know, after Fajr and, you know, you were not able to do it, you know, you just, oh, I was not able, even Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala understands, as we say, because, you know, something happened, you know, I woke up late and what have you. But uh, the Salaf or even pious people of today, they realize that recitation of the, the Quran is it is the nourishment of the heart. It is the food for the soul. And that is why if somebody was not able to recite during the night, then he would recite it during the day. And they also appreciate and they also understand that, or rather they, 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 they are keen on nourishing the heart more than they nourish their bodies. If today somebody is hungry, you know, he would look for food. He is thirsty, he would look for water. But today we find ourselves, you know, you, you, you are thirsty for, you know, the uh, Iman. You are thirsty for Taqwa. You are thirsty, you are hungry for all this. But you don't really, you know, go back and nourish your heart. You don't go back and nourish your faith. You don't think about these things. You just say, I wish I was like, you know, so and so. I wish I was like, you know, the Sahabas. I wish I was like the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And sometimes you even go to the extent of saying, you know, Tilka, you know, Aum, Lahum, Law, you know, those were people, the companions and the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam were, you know, a different people. What you want to you want to fault in a sis and you want to fault it, that's what we say. You know, now actually this is one of the Suburu Shaitan. It is one of the ways of Satan, you know, to beguile you, to cheat you, to lie to you, that you know those are you know different people. And we are different and that is why, you know, I can't be like them. We are supposed to try to be like them. Okay? But again, if you have to look at you know the narration from Imam Muslim where uh, the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam says, who, uh, man nama al -kisbihi, who was not able to recite his his, or you know during the night, especially of course in Qiyam al he should recite it during the day, and of course he will get the rewards there. You find that Qiraat uh, al Quran during the night is one of the means to fortify your iman.